Money, money. Money, money, money. Money, money. No, it's not about the money. It's about the dude on the money. As we discussed in an earlier video, if you want more ideas, meaning output, you need more input. The dude on the $100 bill is Benjamin Franklin, and he was absolutely brilliant at both input and output. But who was Benjamin Franklin? Benjamin Franklin was many things. Printer, writer, inventor, scientist, statesman, civic leader, and diplomat. Franklin was born in 1706 in Boston. That is more than 300 years ago. One more time, more than 300 years ago. So is this story still relevant? Absolutely. Franklin was the youngest son and the 15th out of 17 children. Imagine that, 17 children. His father had to marry twice to make that happen. More importantly, Franklin was a curious child and eager to learn. He was able to read the Bible when he was five years old. When Franklin was eight years old, his father enrolled him in a formal school, but it was expensive. So when Franklin was 10, he had to leave the school and then he had to work in his father's candle shop. That was it. Schooling was over. Benjamin Franklin only had two years of formal schooling. How about that? So Franklin taught himself how to write. And when he was 12 years old, he started working for his brother in his printing shop. There he had more opportunities to both read and write. But Franklin couldn't get along with his brother. So when he was 17, he ran away and ended up in Philadelphia. Franklin worked as a printer. And when he was 21, he started a club together with 11 other tradesmen. That club was called the Leather Apron Club, also known as the Junto. The purpose of the club was to improve themselves and the community. They met every Friday to discuss and debate various topics like politics, science and philosophy. The club basically had two buckets, input bucket, output bucket. Input, who and what can we learn from? Output, who and what can we help? Let me give you some specific input questions. Number one, what are the most important books and writings that we should read? Number two, what are examples of successful projects or ventures that we can learn from? And number three, has anyone recently failed in business and do we know why? And some specific output questions. Number one, how can we apply scientific knowledge to improve our lives? Number two, what is the best way to improve our community? And number three, what are some ways that we can contribute to the betterment of society as a whole? But here's the thing, it was not just a conversation, a discussion, a debate. Over the years, the Junto launched significant initiatives in Philadelphia. Those included volunteer fire companies, a police force, a hospital, a public college. And how did they pay for this? They raised money from members, donors and fundraising events. The club members also shared books for other members to read. That led to the creation of the first public library in Philadelphia, where anyone could borrow books because books were expensive at the time. Franklin allocated an hour every day for his studies and the library provided unlimited material. The Junto was a powerful force for change in Philadelphia and the Junto lasted 40 years. How about that? And it helped shape Philadelphia into the city that it is today. And let me remind you, this was 300 years ago. 300 years. No electricity, no phones. They used candles and oil lamps for light. But they had the printing press. They had newspapers, they had books, and they could write letters. And then they had each other. I mean, in 2023, our lives basically stop functioning when our phone batteries die or we can't get access to Wi-Fi. I hope that Franklin's story show you there's tremendous power in low tech. A small group of dedicated people coming together to learn and help others. Ask questions to learn and generate more input and ask questions to help and produce more output. That's it. I'm done for this week. 
My name is Thomas Bay, and until next time, make things better and make better things. Boom! <laughs>